Hello everyone, I'm Dave Loosely and today I'm going to talk to you about three of my favourite visual close-up pieces of magic. The first is called the credit card change and it looks a little bit like this. This is a perfect prop to carry in an everyday situation. It will always sit in your wallet and will create a very visual moment of magic. It's really easy to do and it looks awesome. And that is the credit card change. The second one is a little trick called pen or pencil. I'd like to show you an optical illusion with a pen and a pencil. I'm gonna take the lid off the pen, okay, and pop the pen in my back pocket. leaves me with the pencil. I'm now going to put the lid on the pencil to cause the optical illusion, if you move it quickly, that the pencil has changed to a pen. It's not great, is it? Uh, actually, I've got, the, uh, I've got the lid on wrong, one sec. There we go, that should be a little bit more convincing. And if you're wondering where the pencil is, well, down here in my back pocket is the pencil. And both of these can be examined. This plays perfect to camera and great in a close-up situation. You do obviously need a pen and a pencil, so it needs to suit the right environment. But if it suits you, the trick itself is superb. The final trick I'm going to talk about today is called Conquer Coins. Now, this is something I use in a real working environment. It happens right in front of their eyes. It's very visual and everything can be examined at the end. So let's take a look at Conquer Coins. So I was recently told quite a funny story about my granddad. Uh, apparently he used to drill holes in all of his change and then thread the change onto a bit of rope and tie the rope to his belt so that nobody could steal his money, which I found quite funny, but it got me thinking. And I want to show you this. I've got here some coins, which I've done the same thing to. I've drilled holes in them, as you can see, uh, and I have a piece of rope as well. So I'm going to place uh, a two P onto the rope, as you can see just here. And that really is on there, it's not coming off. Uh, the 10p, because that's the higher denomination, so it's worth more. So that would always go between the two copper coins, just here, as you can see. So don't take your eyes off this. This is what I would do if he was here today. I would try and get that 10p out of the middle without him knowing. And if I was going to do it, it would look a little bit like this. Three, two, one. There's the 10p, leaving the two 2p's on here. I'll just pull these up and everything can be examined. So there we have three tricks all available at alakazam.co.uk and if you enjoyed this video then please like and subscribe to our channel and join us over on Facebook for all our live updates. But thank you so much for your support and I'll see you soon guys.